Come, sit. I think you'll enjoy this. There's some things from our time. Not my time. My, uh, my mother's, maybe. <laughs> That's just mean. It's hard to make me feel older than I am. But, uh, go ahead. Just take a sip. <laughs> Kombucha. It's wonderful, isn't it? It's good for the gut, too. It reminds you of something. Yeah, my grandmother in Colombia. She made her own. Right before they cut off her drinking water so the rich could water their lawns. Then you are self-made. Hmm. Me too. My first job was flipping burgers, dreaming of the day I'd escape. Well, you certainly did that. That I did. I knew there had to be something more than politics, the dying ecosystem, the memes. Earth was pretty terrible. It got worse after you left. Good for the cult business, though, am I right? <laughs> we weren't a cult. But being right, it's always good for business. Look, I don't mean to be rude, but uh, as I said, I have some experience with people claiming to be gods. Mm. I don't claim that. In fact, I don't even believe in God. I do, however, believe that I was chosen. Mm -hmm. By whom, if not God? We'll find out when we win the war. What if you lose? We won't. For all mankind, is that it? Damn right. You can thank me when we save you, or you can join us. Join your war to save the human race by renouncing everything that makes me human. Love, family, those are the things that connect us, but not just DNA, or emotion. Without that, what are you fighting for? Let me ask you something, doctor. Have you ever done anything you regret in the name of love? I'll take that as a yes. The point is, as we all have, we all fight for our families, our countries. We do whatever we have to so that our side can survive. And when someone you love betrays you, well, that is the worst pain there is. We have none of that here. With all <clears throat> due respect, you can't fight a war for the soul of the human race with an inhuman army. Yes, yes we can. I mean, this life, it doesn't matter. Even lives as long as ours. What matters is what comes next. We're about to find out what that is. The answers that we've both been seeking for so long are finally within our grasp. Isn't that worth a little sacrifice?